News this morning out of Loomis. That's where officers are investigating a gun store break in. CBS 13's Sean Bennett joining us live. He's in Loomis this morning with the latest details. Sean, good morning. Yeah, good morning, guys. And we've talked with the owner of this gun store. He believes only one safe was taken that did have guns inside after a vehicle drove right through the front entrance there. And you can see how big of a hole that is there. The doors knocked out, wires and cables just dangling, drywall scattered in a million pieces, along with plywood and nails and plaster. And it's not only just this hole right over here. Let's go over here and I'll be able to show you the second hole that's on the other side of the building right over here. Owner says that on that side there was basically a wall of fame of pictures of people who were in the military that served from this area and just kind of honoring them. So now that wall is knocked out. Those pictures have been destroyed. The owner's frustrated. He tells us he wants to know who's responsible for this. And he wants to know where the vehicle is. Right now, Placer County Sheriff is the lead agency on this. They're conducting interviews right now with the owner and then also trying to locate that vehicle and that safe with those guns in it. Now, we're being told that most everything else inside the store remained in there except for just the uh, one safe that was taken and then, of course, the significant damage to this building here in Loomis. Guys, we'll send it back over to you. All right, Sean Bennett reporting live for us this morning in Loomis. Sean, thank you.